In this video, we're going to teach you how to paint a large flat surface like the big shield that you'll see the Primaris Captain holding from the Indominus box set. This is part of our painting challenge video series. If you want to learn how you can participate in our painting challenge and get a free membership with the Knights of the Game Table for an entire month, then click the link in the description of this video and sign up now. Now let's dive into painting that shield. So we added color to the bones on the shield and now we're gonna color in the shield itself. For this lesson, we're using Telesar Blue uh, contrast paint from Citadel. Again, we use the grayscale method. It makes contrast painting so much easier and so much better in terms of adding vibrancy and uh, depth to the colors. So here we go. We're just gonna apply the Telesar Blue to the shield, um, have a nice you know, little detailed brush that we're using and um, hold the model with you know everything we can in terms of hands. It's, if you need to use a painting handle, go ahead. But this is this is how we're doing it. So just you know get a nice little thin brush, have a nice tip on there. You don't want to apply too much paint, and you're just going to squeeze in between those places because this is contrast paint. It has a tendency to drip, so you don't want to load the brush with too much paint. Notice the the slight little dips that the tip of the brush is getting into the paint here. And it's, it's a little paint here, cover a small section of the shield, a little paint again on the tip and cover that section. So we're, again, it's, it's the same model of section by section. Start from the top, work your way down. We went from the top right corner of the shield. We're going down, now we're circling back up. So um, this is really handy in terms of getting those finer details. You'll notice the shield itself is already showing, you know, really intense details in terms of light and color gradients. And I'll say it again and again through this lesson series, it's the grayscale method we did to prep. You do the grayscale and you start adding contrast paints to it and painting becomes a lot simpler and a lot faster. And that's the gift we wanna give you in this painting lesson series is how to paint fast, how to paint good, and how to, you know, make things easy. So that's exactly what this is. It's really just like water coloring at this point. You're getting the brush, you're making sure you're patient with your tip, you're holding it properly, and you're painting in those right places to where uh, the drip, the paint isn't gonna drip into the wrong spot. You wanna keep it separate from the other sections because again, we're going through this model section by section. So right now we're just covering the shield plate itself and then uh, we're gonna cut into the finer details of the shield. So we added the blue to it, and now we're gonna go ahead and touch up those purity seals on top. We did the purity seals on the last lesson, and um, we left them out of this, out of the shield because we wanted to get that base down on the shield first. Just like the Space Marine with the armor, we put the armor down, and then we did a touch up on the purity seals. In this instance, we're doing the same thing. We put the blue down on the shield, and then we're touching up those purity seals and getting them you know, looking really good. So we're going back to the snake bite leather, applying those onto the purity seals, applying those onto the, um, you know, sign across. And that's that's kind of the um, the idea here is, is get your bases down, get your sections covered, and then go at it bit by bit and do the touch up. So there you have it. This model is turning out to come out really good. Now the next part of this lesson is gonna be leather and we're gonna cover how to do his belt, his gun holster and every other part that should be a darker cloth color. And that concludes our video on how to paint that big shield and large flat surfaces on 40K models. The next thing we're gonna cover is painting all the leather that this Space Marine's holding. We have some really cool techniques that show texture and depth for the leather pieces. If you're enjoying these videos and you wanna follow along with us and paint along with this tutorial series, then make sure to click the link in the description of this video and sign up for our Knights at the Game Table painting challenge. Once you do that, you'll get access to our full sequence of painting tutorials and you can follow along. And once you finish the challenge, you'll even get free access to our Knights at the Game Table membership for an entire month. So go ahead, click on, join with us in this painting challenge, and I hope to see you in the next video.